Hello everybody, Bob6983 here, and we are back for some more Super Paper Mario. In the last episode, we um, unfortunately lost Bowser in a very epic wrestling match of the ages to O-Chunks. And in this episode, we are going to be continuing through the Castle Black, which is inside the Void. Hopefully being able to finish the game by the end of this week. I'm pretty sure we are going to be able to meet that. So without f uh, any further ado, let's go ahead and jump right in. <coughs> An endless labyrinth of mind-boggling turns and deadly enemies. Ooh, I don't know why that tripped me up. It seems like every time I do the narrator voice, despite how much preparing I do, I always mess it up somehow. This final journey was more dangerous and trying than our heroes had seen before. Mario and friends kept... Oh my gosh. Will I get one narration right, please? Mario and friends kept on without Bowser, who was lost in the duel. There was no time to stop and search for Bowser. Or even greed. Our heroes knew that they had to rush towards the final encounter with Count Black. Chapter 8 2 The Crash. Another tremor. I've lost count of them all. It is strange. I mean,. This is Count Black's private castle, right? So why would he let the destruction ravage his own home? What sort of evil plan is it if he destroys himself in the process? Mm. Plumier, so it really is you. Ahem, uh, let's just keep moving. We need to find Count Black soon. Yeah. Oh, okay. This is Castle Black Foyer! These guys are slightly different than the Sproing or whatever they're called. These guys are called Zoingoing! Ew! They, they're very rare, living only in space between dimensions. And max HP is 12. Yeah, yeah, it's the same thing. Slightly different name, though. Okay. Be careful with this Cursia. It does the exact same stuff as the normal Cursias do. And honestly, I don't remember what normal curses do. I think it just undoes all your skills. I'm not sure. It's been a while since, you know, I've run into the normal ones, like I've said before. These guys are slightly different than the ones that we saw in space. That is a blast boxer. It's, um, okay. For whatever reason, the second word just caught me off guard. Blare sound at anyone it doesn't like. Max HP is 16, and attack is 6. It gets thrown by its own loud noise. It, what? I wonder if its neighbors even ever complain about the noise. Interesting. Merly, why are you here? I guess I now have a pow block. I didn't really need, well, you know what? We're gonna leave. Well, let's take, mm, I have no space for it, so we're gonna leave it. We have the fire burst, so we're, we're still fine. Mr. I, there's two of them this time. I don't know if I can go around both of them and it'll work. I think it won't work. Oh, it does work. Cool. Two for the price of one. A Costco deal. Gotta be weary over here. I swear. Okay, there we go. It was a little delayed, but it's fine. We still got it. We are approaching the new... Ye oh, hold on. Big pause. Oh! <laughs> Oh, you finally arrived! Merlin, what are you doing here? I found a fascinating passage in the Light Prognosticus, so I rushed here to tell you. To get to Count Blake, it seems you must hit this totally unsuspicious block, so why not give it a jolly old whack? Ah, uh, okay, Merlin, let's go ahead and do that. <laughs> what a bunch of. Interesting. <laughs> yeah. But as I was going to say, um, we are approaching the new year. Um, I was thinking of making a video before the year ends, you know, um, just going over everything that's happened this year. But I am not sure if I will have time to make that. I kind of want to still. There's two doors. Um... 
I believe we have to solve this in a certain way, like to... There is a specific way that you need to solve this because only one of these pipes is the correct one. And I believe on each room, there's like a... There's a switch that you have to hit. Yeah. I want to say it's just one to the right and then you're good to go. I think. I'm not, Don't quote me on that. I'm not quite sure. But yeah, um, the new year is approaching. Um, and yeah, I just kind of want to make that video, but I don't think I will be able to get to that. Maybe if I have enough time. Fingers crossed I do, but I'm not sure. Oh, okay, so it's neither of these. So we're looking for the far left one. Is what it seems like. Okay, so we gotta move it three now. It recently dawned on me that ah, it recently dawned on me that I'm a dumbass. Um, it recently dawned on me that I've been going to the gym for about eight months now. And I, I will say, I have seen a big difference. Like, how I've lost a good chunk of weight. I look skill. Where did you come from? I've lost a lot of weight. Um, I want to see maybe about 20 pounds. It's somewhere around there. Not exactly, but you know, like close. But yeah. Oh, we don't. We do not need that. We have plenty of items. That's what we need, a castle block key. Oh, key! Ooh, this I can go ahead and swap with something, anything. Um, This is gradually fills HP. We could get rid of a long last shake. Um, bah, 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 bah. I could technically get rid of the fire burst. We don't really need it. I think I'm getting rid of the fire burst. There we go. Was that everything up here? Whoa. Okay. Well, I mean, I guess I can go down there. I said, let me go down there. Here we go. Here's the key. And then there's the button that. Okay. I lost my train of thought. I was going to continue with my statement, but I don't remember. Ooh, these are Gloombas. Not Galoomba, but Gloomba. Yes, a Gloomba. A Goomba that lives its entire life underground. Max HP is too. So yeah, if you were ever wondering, Goombas are the ones that are just in like the overworld like 1-1. And then the other ones that you see all over the place, the ones that are brown. And then the dark blue ones are the ones that live underground. Like in 1-2. Those are Gloombas. I don't know why they have different names, but yeah, that's just how it is. I guess, respect the lore, I guess. These hammer bros can flip into 3D. They have really good aim, apparently. I don't, I, my bad. I don't think there's anything in this door, but let's go ahead and check. You, soldier boy, tell him. Reverse your curse. Yeah, I don't want you to, you know, do your damage, do your thing on me, so. And then you are a, uh, what is the, what is that curse yet? Heavy curse yet. Makes it so I can't jump. We do not like you. You, soldier boy, tell him again. I'm pretty sure you're the one that makes it so that we can't use, um, our abilities. Oh, slows you down? Oh, okay. Well, I've never really, you know, gotten hit by that. We gonna go over here to the secret path. I mean, I don't know. I honestly don't think it's secret. I, I think we're meant to go here, but like, um, it kind of looks secret. Yes, we're keeping this. There's a lot of really good items this time around. Um, here's what we'll do. We'll use a long, well, no, ah, I'm, in, I'm between a rock and a hard place with this one. We got four life shrooms. We really don't need them, but 
I could heal myself with the long last shake for now, since I'm gonna toss one out regardless. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll I'll take the long last shake and then just um take the other one with me. Oh, we had all of them being down. Cool. Yeah, I, I completely lost my train of thought. I was going to say something, but I, I, I forgot. Oh, also, we can stay in 3D for as long as we want with this, technically, because we're being healed continuously. Yay! If, I guess if you ever wanted to, you know, extend your timer on your 3D, you could technically do a long last shake, and you could just stay like that forever. Until it runs out. We don't really need these fire bros to be doing that, bro. Okay, what is in this room? Oh, a trap. From, uh, Merle's Mansion. I think we actually have to, yeah, forcefully take them. Even though they do heal us, we have to take all of them until we find which one has the key. I don't remember what room you are. What is... Oh, wait. I, I, I know what room this is. I can't actually reach you. So, um... What we're gonna do is... This. There we go. I... I... I didn't really expect the key to pop up like that. That was very weird, but you know what? I'll, I'll take it. I don't think we need any of the other rooms, but I believe one of the rooms has um, the like a family member of the Slurps, the ones that t intake bombs. And there's two of them, and you cannot leave the room until you defeat all the two of them, and each of them takes about two boomer explosions, so... I would say avoid that one. Uh, and of course, you know, three mushrooms to heal yourself. There's a save block right here. Not the boss room, but close to the boss room. How magnificent you have arrived. I saw it in the stars you would survive. Heroes do not flee, for I am the lovely and mysterious Burly. My beauty and the stars led you here. Rest now, for you have nothing to fear. Um, are you really Merly? Whatever is it that you imply? How could anyone wonder if it is I? Look at this lovely aura glow. Does it not tell you all you need to know? Ah... I will ask you questions, three. The answers will hold your future's key. And you must answer each one and every question honestly and fairly. Here we go. Time to start the show. Which one of these beasts is the hardest for you to make deceased? Ah, uh, okay. So this will determine what you will face up ahead. This is also a thing that I'm pretty sure is in... Paper Mario 64. I believe I ran into something along along these lines. Um, you guys do the Goomba, the Club, or the Ultra Shroom. I'm pretty sure you all should know which one to pick. But if it's not obvious, pick the Ultra Shroom. If you want the points, technically you can go for the Goomba and the Club, but I'm going with the Ultra Shroom. Hehe. <laughs> so that one there gives you the biggest scare. Next, which one of these fearsome three most rattles your knees? You can go for fuzzies and hammer buzz again if you want the points, but I'd say go for the thunder rage. It's, you know, it's an item to help you out in battle. I'd say go for it. I really don't want to deal with fuzzies or hammer buzz, so yeah, look, I'm going to pick that. You are most scared of these? <laughs> That's good to know. Now, what of these do you despise like fleas? You can pick the Amazing Daisy. I'm I I, I the Amazing Daisy kind of sounds you know like worth it. Cooking mistake. I kind of want to show off because it's a room chock full of them. 
Oh, also, if you pick Francis, you will have to do that boss fight all over again. So be careful with what you want. Um, I'll go with the amazing Daisy. Why not? That is what makes you so very furious indeed. How very curious. Well, it's been marvelous fun, but I'm afraid our time together is quite done. But do not fear, Fred. No, we shall meet again yet. <laughs> okay. So, we had the Ultra Shroom, I believe. There it is. It's a scary object. Oh, you can even grab it. Cool. But yeah, you know, a, a max heal. An item for us. And... The last room could have an amazing daisy. <gasps> Look at the little guy. What if I just like? <gasps> Bro's running. No, 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 no. Come back. Come back. Come back. How do I fight you? Would this work? <gasps> it does. No, come back! I, I want I want to see if I can beat this thing. You are a very fast creature. Man. I wonder. Oh, man. Let's do the meteor meal. I want to see this. I did 20 damage and you're still not down for the count! Uh, count Black himself, heaven is. Oh, wait, 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 wait. This, this, this could be easy. I could just fleep you. There we go. And you give us a daisy, dear. We can actually make another one of these daisy syrups. That's awesome. I have never encountered an amazing daisy in this game. I have encountered them in uh, Paper Mario 64. They are a nuisance to deal with. You have to do a lot of batch setups to actually defeat one. Or, you know, do it in the post game, but I'm glad that we were able to defeat one. Yay! Oh. Ah! What are you trying to do? Oh, impossible! I put everything you hate in there. How'd you get through all that icky stuff? Unless you bad people were lying. How dare you lecture us! You were just pretending to be Merlin and Merle. Talk about a dirty trick! You should be ashamed of yourself! Ashamed? Of myself? I like getting what I want, so I do whatever I need to get it. You're the one that's always having to go get rescued by boys. That's embarrassing! Polly, you sure are a lot of talk when you have your little boy friends to protect you. Very well. If you insist, I'll give you what you so richly deserve. Princess Peach, you're not really going to... Stay out of this! I am a princess! And she has to admit my dignity! You two leave me be! Understood? Yeah. Aww. The pretty little princess wants to face me all alone? Boy. It sure would be sad if your boyfriends had to cry over spilled peaches. Me 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 me. Me me. Try not 
to cry, or all your pretty makeup will run. Time to go bye bye, princess. Okay, the second battle against Mimi is going to be a bit more tricky, as you know, um, there's going to be a lot more things up her spider arms, up her sleeves. I'm not sure. Okay, that's two hits. I didn't really mean to do that, but you know, granted, it's fine. Okay, she's a lot faster than normal. Ow! Oops. What we need to do for this specifically is go into Peach's umbrella form here, or parasol form. You take no damage whatsoever. If you ever need, you know, time to um, take a breather, I'd highly recommend going to that form. You're gonna go on top of the wall. There we go. Okay, makes one leg. Oh, you're gonna do that again. Awesome. Cool. I can't even take one of the rubies off of you. Yeah, not yet. Now you're going up. Go! Stop it. There we go. Oh, you're going the other way. Interesting. This is interesting. The, the wave of rubies tossing us all over the place. How oh, awesome. You're going to spin again. Thank you, Mimi, for wasting a lot of our time, but it's fine. You know what? You're a boss fight, so we should take you seriously. Man, you just slightly raised yourself, making me and making it impossible for me to hit you. There we go. One more. Oh, you're doing that again, are you? I find it interesting how her spider legs mesh into one long stick. That way she can do this. It's very interesting for an attack. Ah, you're very fast. The more legs she loses, the faster she is, so be careful. Ah, I didn't grab it right. There we go. Okay, drop down. Ah, I floated. Okay, cool. Awesome. Put the leg down. There's only two left. I can't even get over there in time. Okay, no, we're fine. We're good. We're good. We just need one more leg, I think. All right, come on, Mimi. Let's go ahead and wrap this up. You are very fast going diagonally very quickly. I believe I can maybe jump here. Ah, there we go. And we're good to go. I don't get it. I got beat by a princess? Wah! You? Oh, what's the matter, little girl? Did I spank Mimi a little too hard? You did it, princess. The destruction is spreading. If we dawdle any longer, we're doomed. You're right. Let's go. Mimi, you can't stay here. Go find somewhere safe. Yeah, right. Like you care. Ah! What was that loud noise? Princess? It, it won't open. Oh no! You silly princess, what are you doing? What? What am I doing? I just leapt into action without even thinking. I don't want your stupid help. Just, just leave me alone. No, I can't do that. You have been very, very bad. 
but I can't leave you here to die. I don't know how you were raised, but I was taught to help people in need. Peach? Wait, I've got you? The whole castle shook, and now that door won't open? Yeah. First Bowser, and now the princess. W what do we do, bro? Hmm. We have to keep going. B but we can't leave the princess. I know it's horrible, but this is, well, the end of the world. Of all worlds, really. We must press on. Princess Peach would want it this way if she were here. <sighs> well, yeah. I guess that is a Princess Peach thing to say. I'm worried about Peach, but she'd probably be mad at us for wasting time. Okay, bro. Let's go. With another person out of the party, we are two-fourths of a hero group. Or rather, half of a hero group. Things are not looking too good for us. I mean, we're taking people out. Um one after the other but we're also losing people that's not really good um so yeah next time on super paper mario we will continue hopefully we keep the remainder of our parties because we don't really have much else to give up so until next time i guess see you all then for 8-3 end of chapter